Today we play Super Mario Odyssey, but Mario can launch out rockets, and he has the jetpack named Flood from Super Mario Sunshine. There's so much that we can do with this game. Thank you so much for watching, and I really hope you enjoy this video. So instead of Mario having the spray nozzle, he can launch out a rocket like this and explode a bunch of stuff, so I'm really excited to see what we'll be able to do with that. And there's also a bunch of new tricks that I've learned how to do with Flood and the other nozzles that we have. So that should be very exciting to see what we can do. So first of all, we obviously don't need to use that over there because we can just hover across like this. Now, will we be able to get high enough to skip this? That is the question. Let's try our best at this. Let's go like, okay, now let's just get boosted up again, okay? And can I get boosted a third time also? Let's see. And, oh man, look at that, we made it up. Oh boy, we skipped that entire tower. That's fantastic that you can do that. And it is lovely that your water just keeps coming back. But, oh, 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 and, and, we're gonna get to use this at this boss fight. Let's see how well this rocket will work. Go, oh, oh, I just took off his hat. Oh, go, 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 go. Now explode him. Oh no, I missed, oh no, we got him, we got him, we got him. Okay, that's amazing. Wait, now where are you? Wait, my camera angle's a little weird. Wait, which one is he? Is he this one? Nope, that one's just a heart, that's all right. Are you this one? Oh, that's gonna be the one. Okay, wait, let's jump on him. Or wait, can I launch my rocket at him? Go, rocket! Hey, I missed! Let's go like this, let's take off his hat. And now, get up, rocket! No, I exploded myself! Okay, I know I could just jump on him, but I've gotta do this. There we go! Wait, did I get him or no? What's going on? Come on. Come on! It's so hard to get him! Okay, come on. Let me just get this guy with the rocket. There we go! That hit counted! Okay, I guess that explosion was close enough for it to hit him. All right. So apparently, this is actually the only capture in the game you need to do if you're playing with this mod, which is kind of crazy to think. So we'll try and avoid a few captures if we can. Okay, so here we are, the Cascade Kingdom. So normally, what you want to do here is capture that chain chomp, but what if we go like that? Perfect! We can just explode that rock with our rocket. So, and we can just grab the power mode like that. That's a nice and easy first power mode. So we are, of course, not going to be capturing the dinosaur this time, but... What we might be able to do is let's give this a shot. Normally, you want to use the chain chump or the dinosaur to get through here. Okay, we can just blast through like that. That's a nice and easy way to get that power boot. Chomp through the rocks. Yeah, we didn't really do a lot of chomping there. But let's see how high we can get up here. Is that high enough? Oh, you know what? You know what? You know what? Let me up. Let me up. Come on. Let me up. Let me up. Let me grab it. There we go. Okay, we grabbed it like that. Okay, there's probably an easier way to get there, but that worked. Oh, and since we can apparently do this without many captures, can we just go like this? Get her. No, I missed her. Oh, no. And we're getting damaged. Okay, there we go. Did I just damage the boss? Okay, it looks like we actually damaged the boss there, which is pretty cool. Because I did see some coins come out there. So let's go like this. No. Go. Gotta get her. And... There we go! Oh man, that's so funny! Oh boy, she looks like she's shaking it up there. Oh, and if we could get a heart there, that'd be nice. Whoa! The chain jump is just spinning around like that. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! I just launched the rocket at my feet. I have to stop doing that. It's hard to control the rocket sometimes. But there we go, the boss is defeated. That's so funny that if you launch the rocket at the boss... Wait a minute, what is happening to the hat up there? Why is the pink hat just floating up there? But that's actually so funny that that does count as a hit if you use the rocket like that. That is super cool. Oh, and, and, we've gotta try this because sometimes some funny stuff happens when you do this. Wait, can I still move or no? Because here's Mario. Oh, maybe it doesn't do it for this power moon because some power moons when you use the rocket nozzle into them, some weird stuff happens. You guys are gonna see that later in this video. Okay, so we do have our power moons. We were able to get them pretty quickly and this seems like a mod that would make speedrunning this game quicker because there's just so much more stuff that you have access to. So there's stuff that you should be able to do that you wouldn't be able to otherwise do. Okay, I'm going to try something that might not be a very good idea. This is what I'm going to try. I am going to try, because I saw that you could do this. I'm, oh, no, 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 no. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, here's what I wanted to do. What I wanted to do was launch this rocket at the bird. Get it, please. Come here. No. Come here, bird. Come here. Oh, my goodness. We got the bird with the rocket. We got it. That is wild. Okay, and now we should be able to just get this. 
Power move there! Oh, I'm so glad that that worked. That is so difficult to aim sometimes. It's just like when you can launch rockets in Super Mario Sunshine. That's what it feels like we are doing. So, we should be able to just float on over like that. Get this power moon. There's another nice one for us. And we can just drop into this pipe and get another lovely power moon here. Wait, I wonder something. I wonder if we could do this. Because normally you want to ground pound right here. But what if we just go like that? Oh, no. Wait, is that not the spot? I thought it was here. Okay, I don't want to accidentally defeat myself. We might be doing that if we're not careful, though. Or is the power moon up here? Go oh, there. Okay, it does work. Okay, I was just shooting at the wrong spot. But that's so cool that you don't even have to ground pound there. You can just do that. Okay, there's no way that this will work, right? But I've got to try this. Can you break the ice with the rocket? Wait, did a coin? Did a coin come out? Was that coin there before? Okay, so we know that there is a power moon up on top of, I believe it's up on top of that hill there. So let's make our way here and let's do this because now we know that this does work. So let's just go like this, just straight down there and out comes the power moon. That is so cool. Oh, and there's something that I also want to try to do. I want to show you guys what happens when you use the rocket nozzle when you're under a power moon because sometimes some funny stuff can happen. So let's just float on up here. That was fantastic. Okay, right now we're not under this power moon, so we can't really do that here. But there should be some other cool stuff that we can do, I think. So let's just come here first. This will be a nice place to go. Don't even want to touch the sand. We don't want to get dirty from touching the sand. Let's just go like that. Get the power moon. Perfect. Now let me float out nicely with flood. Hopefully I still have water. I don't want to touch the sand. Oh, this would be super cool to do in Floor is Lava, but the funny thing is, I did this in Floor is Lava already, actually. So, let's come here. I saw JustCont8 do this. JustCont8 is the mod creator. Let's switch to this nozzle. Let's go like this. And it's so hard to aim. Okay, let's try again. We can do this. We can do this. We can just go here and explode that. Okay, good. We did explode it. I wasn't sure if we exploded it or not. And... Does it spawn right on us? The moon spawns right on us. That's so good. Now, you know what else there is? There's also... Oh, hold on. There's also something over there. Normally, you want to capture a bullet bill and explode that, but we can just use our rocket, which is another great option. And wait, wait, wait. Can we try this now? Let's see. Ah, I pressed the wrong button. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, I'll have to do it on the next one then. Okay, so we could get this easily it's so easy to get power moons there's so many power moons that you can get so easily like this and now we can just float across to there without any problem we don't even have to go and capture that bullet bill you can just go like this go like this get some coins get a power moon and everything is just so easy okay so let's try getting up a little bit and we should be able to use the boost again and is that enough you know what let's go like this and then you can just float to the top from there, from way back there. You can make it up to the top there. I learned how to do double rocket boosts now, and now we are unstoppable. We can get anywhere now. And I've showed you guys this before. There's some cool stuff that you could do if you use the rocket nozzle right as you come into a pipe like that. Wait, where are we? Oh, clip in here, and there we go. We got a moon. Okay, yeah, so this room is actually under the tower like that. So that's how we got in here. That's not actually what I was trying to do. There's actually a different thing that I wanted to show you guys. But that is another cool thing that we can do. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Okay, there's actually something else that I was trying to show you guys here. Hold on. Let's just see how it works. And there we go. We just got boosted like that because I used the rocket right as we came in. And then we were able to just boost straight up like that, which is quite funny. And we should be able to use it from here. Yeah, look at that. Look how high we are now. Wow. Okay. So, it shouldn't be too difficult to make our way over to there, especially from here if we go like this, because then we can just hover over without any issue at all like this. But, even if we weren't up high, even from down here, we should be able to make it up. Last time, in the previous video, I did a nice boost off of that piece of ice there. But now that I know how to double rocket boost, what if we just try making it up there from the ground? What if we go like this? Can we get enough rocket boosts? Let's see. Go like that. Okay, then stop. Swap. And the reason that I'm going into snapshot mode is because you can continue to charge up the rocket while you are, uh, 
in snapshot mode like that. Yeah, so there we go. I got three rocket boosts there, and that brings you more than high enough to reach. And I think that we don't even need that power moon there, because I think that from defeating this boss, we get a multi-moon. Let's see. Let's try and defeat this boss. This could be a nice boss to defeat. Come on, throw your thing at me. And... No! No! Don't shoot at the floor! I don't want to shoot at the floor. I want to shoot at the boss. Go. No! Stop shooting at the floor! Oh no, I keep shooting at the floor. This is so sad. Hey, okay, here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna throw that at me. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna launch this at you. Come here! Is that close enough? Yes! That is close enough for the hit. Okay, that's great. That's great. Now, where are you going? Go! Oh no! Go! Okay, got you there. Okay, now I need you to throw another one of your bombs at me. And then I'll attack you with my rocket. Let's go like that. And come here! Did that hit count or no? No, that hit didn't count. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Go. Ah, oh, I keep shooting at the floor. Go. No, your hat came on before I could get you. Oh my goodness. This is so tricky sometimes. Okay, go and there we go. Okay, that hit is close enough. It's so funny that I've attacked the Brutals twice like that now where my explosion goes off on the barrier. And then as a result of that, the hit is close enough to count. Okay, that should be the boss defeated now. Okay, that's super cool that we can defeat the boss with rockets like that. And wait, is something special going to happen with this or no? Let's see. Okay, I guess we just collect this power moon normally again. I've got to use the rocket nozzle to go through a power moon and show you guys the weird thing that happens because I've seen some weird stuff before. Okay, so it is now nighttime and we do have enough power moons to go to the next kingdom luckily. So let's go to the next kingdom. All right, so we've made it to the lake kingdom. Let's see how good my aim is now. Now. And yeah, all right, we got the power move just like that. All right, maybe I am starting to get the hang of this. So normally you could just do a really easy jump to over there, but we do have the rocket, so why not use the rocket? Wow, great jump. Cappy said, wow, great jump. It's actually so funny that Cappy said, wow, great jump, but we are just using flood to get up actually. Okay, now can we get boosted like this? Let's go boost me up again. And that is of course, high enough to make it to here and get the power moon. Why is there an empty picture frame here? Because we're not supposed to be here yet, Cappy, that's why. I had a really funny comment on one of my videos where, uh, you guys know how sometimes when you play a game, sometimes you just talk to the NPC, sometimes you go, well, Cappy, the reason is because of this. Uh, someone once commented on, uh, one of my videos and they said, uh, you know they can't understand what you're saying, right? And I thought that was just so funny. It's like, yes, yes, I am aware. I am aware that Cappy is not a real person. Oh, and something cool that we could also do is use this nozzle to swim quite quickly here. Oh, and I wonder if we could use the rocket nozzle right here. It's kind of weird calling it the rocket nozzle, though, because we already do have the rocket nozzle. That's something that Just Kant was saying, too, that it isn't really a spray nozzle. It's kind of like a spray nozzle with the rocket connected to it, but we do have a rocket nozzle, so what do you even call this nozzle here? And you know what? That is actually enough power moons, basically, so let's just go up to the top now and wait. Oh, I was wondering if I could use the rocket nozzle from down here, from underwater, but I guess not really. So let's come on up like this and just go to this boss. Wow, this game is so fast with flood. And we should be able to defeat this guy without too much trouble, too. I'm not even gonna use that. It's gonna go like this, hey! Oh no, oh no, oh no, what is going on? Okay, you stop. Here, let's go like this. Come! Is that close enough? That's not close enough to get him. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no! Oh no, I'm actually getting hurt. This isn't good. This isn't good. Let's see. Okay, go like this. Now let's get him. And I exploded his hat. Not him. Okay, come. Let's go like this now. I will explode you, bro. I am exploding myself! I'm going to die to this boss! Okay, let's go. Come. I can't hurt him! I can't hurt him! This is so hard! Okay, let's go like this. I'm dead! Oh, and I continue from here. I didn't expect to spawn here. I'm not sure where I expected to spawn, but I didn't expect it to be here. Oh, and look, there are the coins from back when I died. Oh, hello there, Brutals. I'm gonna join you on your ship. It looked like I was gonna jump onto the ship with them. Okay, let's go like this. Now you, come here, there we go! He looks like he really got flattened from that. Oh, and maybe I should try and jump on him here? What if I go like this? Oh, I thought that I'd be able to jump onto him. Let's see, okay, give me your hat! Give me your hat, bro! Give me your hat! Hey, ay ay 
Okay, give me your head again, bro. Come. You stop, okay? And I'm gonna get you like this. Did that hit not count? It looked like it exploded right beside it, but it didn't look like it hurt. Okay, let's try again. Come. Okay, that's not close enough. That's okay. Let's see. Okay, there we go. Now we should get him. We should get him. We should get him. Are you not getting hurt anymore? Did my attacks not affect you anymore? Oh, there we go. Now it affected him. Oh, I guess it wasn't close enough to his head. Because you probably have to, uh... You probably have to make the explosion be near his head for the damage to count. That makes sense, because it's like, that's what his hitbox is! Okay, so let's go up near his head. And I thought that would have worked. That looked like it would have worked, because the explosion, it looked like it was near his head. Let's try again. There we go. That's got to be it, right? There we go. Okay, now he's defeated. Okay, so the hitboxes on these brooms, especially on this one, this one can be a little bit difficult to hitbox there. And that is already enough power moons to make it to the next kingdom. So next up is the Wooded Kingdom. And something really cool about the Wooded Kingdom... Wait, wait, wait. First, I want to see if we can get the rabbit with the rocket. This would be wild if this works. Wait. Oh, oh, it only stuns the rabbit. It doesn't actually uh, make the... Whoa, it doesn't actually make the power moon spot. It only stuns him as if you're throwing Kathy at him. That's kind of funny. But yeah, something cool about the Wooded Kingdom. Wait, I've got to try this too. Hey, that actually works. That's so cool. Oh, I'm so glad that that worked. Normally, you have to pick up that rock and then you have to either throw it around... Or, if you carry it and you run into another rock, then your rock breaks immediately. So that could be a quick way to get the power moon, but it's super cool that you could just throw flood at it. Or sorry, not throw flood at it. Launch a rocket at it using flood. But yeah, what I was gonna say is this kingdom, this just seems like a kingdom that was designed to have flood in it. It just feels so natural using flood in this kingdom. Okay, so there is a thing for us right up here. Oh! Oh, no, we fell! Well, I guess falling isn't that big of a deal, because we can just get back up like that quite easily. And we are also getting power moons in this kingdom quite quickly. There are a lot of kingdoms where you could get power moons very quickly. Wait! What if I don't want to use Cappy? Did I just go around like this? Let's try this. I think we should be able to get up somewhere nice here, right? What if we go up here? Oh, there's a ceiling there, so maybe not here. Okay, stop sliding down the wall, Mario. And another thing that a lot of people have been asking me to play is... Wait a minute, there are steps there? There are steps there? Okay, let's go onto those steps then. And sure, I guess we're up here now. Wow, I actually don't know if I knew about those steps. Okay, well, I guess we're up here now. But yeah, something that a lot of people have been asking me to play... Oh, oh, and, 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 I also have to check this. What if we do this? Because normally, you've got to use the shrooms to blast this wall apart here. Oh, no. Oh, no, that missed. Okay, let's try again. But something that people have been asking me to play is uh, my mod where I made Super Mario Odyssey, but Mario slides up walls. People were asking me to play through Super Mario Odyssey using that mod, so I might have to do that sometime. I think that'd be really cool. Where is the power moon? I thought there was a power moon around here. Maybe it's in the top left. I thought, oh, 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 yeah, I can see that it's right there. Oh, no. Oh, no, I can see it right there from behind that gap. But if only I can control my rocket to get there. Perfect. Okay, and now, instead of just jumping up, we can just nicely get up with the help of Flood and a ledge grab. That's a nice and easy power boon to get behind the rock wall. I don't know if they normally get that one in speedruns, but that's fine that we got that. Now, where do we even want to go now? There's so much that we can do. I remember being around here a lot in Super Mario Odyssey, but the floor is lava, especially when we played through that with Flood. But wait, there's another power moon somewhere around here, right? Oh yes, there's one right here. That'll be a perfect spot for- Oh, and... Should just be able to launch a rocket into that. Perfect! That is a lovely power moon to get. Over the cliff's edge. I'm getting such weird power moons. These are power moons that you don't normally get in a speedrun of this. At least as far as I'm aware, you don't normally get these. But where do we even want to go now? I know that there are a bunch of sub areas over there. Oh! And is the moon right here? Perfect, perfect. Okay, there's just one right here for us. Let's just, let's just learn to aim. Okay, wait! It didn't explode it in one hit. I would have thought that the rocket would explode it in one hit. Okay, but there we go. Now we've got, oh, oh, and let's see if this works because sometimes this is really weird. 
Maybe this has been patched, because sometimes when you use the rocket nozzle to boost into a power moon like that, sometimes some wacky stuff can happen, but so far, things have been looking pretty normal. What if we go like this? Okay, wait, did that even hurt it? Oh, now launch again, and I'm not taking it out in a single hit. Come on now. Oh, that was very strange. Okay, what if I come up close? Explode it now. Do it. Okay, it hurt me, but that's all right. Climb the cliff to get the nut. I don't know if we really climbed the cliff. We kind of went around in a very strange way. I wonder if we can damage fuzzies with this, because fuzzies in this game are normally some enemies that are a little bit difficult to deal with, so maybe this could actually help us. I wonder if it will. Let's see if I go like that. Wait, did I defeat a fuzzy or no? I'm not sure if I did. Let's try again. Come on now. It is incredibly difficult to aim with this. I just want to get some fuzzies. Wait. Oh, I don't think they get destroyed. Look at how their eyes are bulging out like that. They have very bulgy eyes. But yeah, okay. It looks like we are not taking them out, unfortunately. Or fortunately, depending how you look at it. But we should be able to get up like this without any problems at all and get that power moon. And then there's just going to be one power moon at the end. I always get damaged in this section here. These got these spinning guys here, they just, ah, they always get me like that. I can never make it past them. I don't know how to make it past without getting damaged. I have seen people do that before, getting past nice and quickly without getting damaged, but I just always get damaged there. So where shall we go now? Maybe we can just boost up like this. Give me another, oh, my second rocket boost didn't work. Oh, and these guys are coming for me. Uh-oh, uh-oh, looks like we've got to run now. We've got to run now, we've got to be careful. Boost me up, please, thank you very much. Okay, and now, wait a minute, wait a minute. Do we need this guy to get up here? We probably do, I don't think we can just get up like this, right? No, uh, even if we use the rocket nozzle, we can't push it up. Looks like we need this guy over here so that we can push this up and then we can get through. And now we should be able to make it up and there will be a nice power moon for us right in there. Okay, I was worried that my game would freeze for a second. I thought, uh-oh, what's happening? Okay, but we're all right. Okay, so there should be a lot of power moons around here. Well, I don't know about a lot, but at least a few. We should be able to at least get this one. Wait, wait, wait. Let's take him on with the you-know-what with our new weapon. Let's go. Attack! What the? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's proving to cause some trouble. What if I go from here? What am I exploding on? Want to attack you. Go. There we go. Oh, man. That was super cool how we took it out. Okay, but let's see. What else do we need? We need one of these. Or you know what? Rocket, boost me through. Okay, you know what? Let's just ground pound through and get that power moon. Perfect. Okay, and I want to try one more time just to be certain. Let's try that. Yeah, okay. Oh, wait, but this is just uh, one of these uh, power moons where you spin around like that. Oh, and you know what? I guess we don't have to go into that tower now because there should be an easy power moon for us that we can just get here. And then after that, we can just go and face the boss because the boss should give us a multi-moon. Let's just do this. Explode this, please. Even if it explodes us, that's okay, because we do get healed once we get the power moon, which is nice. Now, can we make it to the boss from here? I think we can, but we might have to time this nicely. Oh, actually, that's just super easy. I could just swap from rocket to this. Oh, hello, Brutals. Brutals, I would like to be one of you. I wanted to join them on their ship. Okay, now, can I defeat this guy? That is the question. Go, Flood. Wait. Go, 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 come on, launch, no, no, it's so much easier to just jump on him, I think, I don't know what my rocket is exploding on there, let's try this, go, I keep exploding on the floor, okay, I want to damage him at least once with flood, I think that'd be very nice if I could damage him at least, okay, you know what, I think I'm gonna use this rock to heal right now, because I know that there's a heart in there, I'm gonna try this, Get him, stomp his head. Cappy, I know, I know. Come on, I just want to try using Flood, okay? Just want to try using Flood to just damage him just once. It'd be nice if we could damage him just once. You know what? Since we can't damage him, what if we try and run away? Uh, even if you try and run away, if you get that high, you get put into a bubble. You can't really run away from him. Okay, let's try this. Go. 
Why is it always exploding before we can get to him? Oh, this is so strange. You know what? I'm just gonna jump on his head because it seems like... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Gotta jump on him. Oh, he's going the wrong way! He wasn't going the wrong way. I just timed it badly. Okay, but we do want to get up here now. Oh, let's see. Can you boost me up again? Wrong nozzle. Oh, how am I still alive? That's so ridiculous. That's... That's so ridiculous that I was still alive there. Okay, but now we can get up to this boss. I'll play it a bit more carefully now. Let's go like this. Okay, then swap to that, then to that. Okay, now just wait for it to charge up. Boost me up again. And now, without any issues, we'll be able to reach the Brutal and take on the Brutals. Okay, so let's do this. I'll throw that at you and jump on your head. Okay, now come here. Come. I'm ready. Come. Let's go. I'll jump. There we go. Now this will be a super easy fight. Let's just knock your hat off and then jump on your head like that. Super, super easy. Okay, now just pay attention. Now jump. There we go. And this is a nice and fast way to do this boss. Now just jump on his head. Jump on his head. Come on, we couldn't even do a damage list. That is so sad. So sad over here. So sad. Very sad times. But the good news is we can get a power moon. And now we have enough power moons to make it to the next kingdom. Okay, so let's go to the next kingdom. You know what? There's something that I'm quite curious about. Are we going to be able to take on Bowser like this? Are we going to be wait, let me. Alright, oh, we boosted it to him like that, okay. But yeah, here is Bowser. Something that I'm really curious about is, will we be able to damage Bowser like this? What if we go like this? Okay, now, go Rocket! Oh no, I exploded into the hat! No, 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 let me attack Bowser. Okay, something that I'm really curious about is, will we be able to damage Bowser like this? Hey, that looks like it didn't even hurt him! My aim was perfect, okay, maybe you actually can't hurt Bowser like that. Or maybe it does a tiny, tiny, teeny amount of damage only. Okay, but we can just hover over like this. That's an easy way to avoid that. And now we can just punch Bowser like this. And you know what? Let's even float. We can just keep floating like this. Oh, I thought Bowser would be swinging his tail. So I thought if we just hover like this, then he won't hurt us. And I think he's not going to blow his fire because this is only the first Bowser fight of the game. So let's see where we going. Go like this. And that's the cap that we need. Come on over, Cappy, and come. Hey, why didn't the cap come to me? Oh no, it's not working. I don't know what happened there. I don't know why that didn't work there. Okay, let, oh boy, that didn't work. Cause I see speedrunners, they do this one cool thing where they throw Cappy like that and then they make Bowser's Cappy come towards them. They go like this or something and then the cap comes like that and then they're able to just hit Bowser right away. I almost dove into him there. Okay, but let's go like this. Wait, can he get me up here or no? Whoa! Oh no, oh no, oh no. I am down to only one HP. I've actually got to be a bit careful here. Because if Bowser hits me again, or if I run into him by accident, then we're dead and we have to redo this boss fight from the very beginning. There's a heart right there. Let me get the heart, 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 let me get the heart. Yeah! We got the heart! Let's go. Oh, and there's another heart for us. But we don't need that heart. We don't need it, Gary. We don't need a heart, Gary, because we can just go like this, Gary. And we're going to get that Bowser, Gary. Yes, we are, Gary. We're going to dive through his boulders, and we're going to punch this Bowser here. And that's... Oh, let's float for a moment. Come a bit closer. And there we go. I thought that we would get hurt from floating into Bowser. But there we go. Bowser is defeated. Can we save Princess Peach now? No. Because what Bowser does, of course, is he is going to start firing at us from his ship. And guys, I still remember the first time that I ever played this game. That ever since about this point in the game, I thought that every kingdom would be the final kingdom of the game. It just always seems like the game is about to end. And I actually had a video. It was called something like Mario Odyssey, but I always think the game is about to end. It was part two of my Mario Odyssey playthrough. I'm so glad that so many people have been enjoying that series. It's such a fun game. So we are now in the Lost Kingdom. Oh, and you know what? Not only is this super cool with Flood, but with the rocket that we can launch out, there should be all kinds of other cool stuff that we could do also. Oh yeah, and our Odyssey is destroyed. So let's go over here, and even without doing that jump, it should be super easy to just float over like this. Yeah, like we could just come on over here. Not a problem. We even did this kingdom in- Oh boy, I almost went too far there actually. Okay, but let's just get that moon. Very nice that we got that moon. Okay, now I could also charge up my rocket, I think. Oh, I thought that I could have charged up my rocket there. But, oh, 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 we need this uh, butterfly right here. Go, butterfly! There we are. Let's just get the moon without falling. Very nice. Okay, now let's just charge up our rocket. Hopefully our rocket is charged up nicely. And now, 
boost me up. Okay, now stop for a second. Oh boy, I didn't stop. Okay, hopefully we're not wasting too much water. Boost me again. And there we are. We made it up to the top. Being able to do a double rocket boost like that is super cool. Now, what else do we want from here? Let's see. Oh, and I probably shouldn't have gotten that checkpoint flag, actually. Let's just come down to right here. There's an easy power moon for us. You can get power moon so quickly like this. Now, wait, do I have the... That's not the nozzle I thought I had out. Okay, wait, there we go. Now we have the hover nozzle out. And if we ground pound here, I think there's also a moon here. Yes, perfect. And now we want to get rid of that bird, that klepto bird, because that bird, it steals your cappy sometimes, and it's really annoying when that happens. Let's just come on up here first, get the power moon. Good job floating into it. Tell me I'm not dying now. Tell me I'm not dying. Tell me I'm not dying. Good, we can keep floating so we do not die here. Now just come here, bird, go over there. I am going to do a massive ground pound here. I'm gonna boost up like this and ground pound really hard so that bird should really go flying. Guys, do you ever use, do you call those teeter-totters or seesaws, the things that they have in playgrounds like that? You guys ever use those? Man, I remember being on those as a kid. Fun times, isn't it? Okay, now what we can do is let's try this. Let's see how good our aim is. Now go down. Oh boy, I missed, but, but I should be able to do this one. Come on now. Oh boy, got them all, let's go. That's so cool that we could just break that like that. That is really cool the way that that works. Okay, let's grab this. Now we get a power moon, we need three more. Okay, so there's one right here, then there's the one down there, and then there's also the one that we could get from breaking the cage. So let's also get that one. Let's just go like this first. Let's drop down. Now boost me up, boost me up. I'd like to be boosted, please. Boost me, rocket. Oh, why is that? Oh, there we go. Now it's working. Okay, I was wondering when it would start to boost us. Okay, so... We should be able to just, uh... Get that one right there, right? Just like that! All right, we got it very nice. Now, let's just go straight into that, and we can... Collect the power moon! Oh boy, sometimes when you let go of the hover nozzle, you still keep going forward a bit, and you think, no, no, I must stop. It is time to stop. Okay, but we now have enough power moons for this kingdom. Okay, that was a weird crouch there. Now that we have enough power moons here, it is time to go to the Metro Kingdom. And we'll be taking on the boss there, which is one of the hardest bosses in the game. Okay, so it is the Metro Kingdom, and it's also all rainy. From here, we should be able to make this jump without flood, assuming that I can do it correctly. And that might actually not work, but we made it! Hooray! Wait, wait, wait. What if you, uh, I was hoping that maybe you could use flood on this. Oh, look at this, if you jump, if you're in the air, then you do spray out water. You don't keep floating though. Oh my goodness, I could shoot out a rocket like that while driving on the motorcycle. What about this, can we use this? Whoa, what the, the way that I'm standing is so weird. What in the world is going on? This is such a weird way to move. We're spraying out water while we're driving. Mario, you should use hands when you're driving on your bike. This is very dangerous. Mario, I do not recommend. Look at the way that he's driving. He's like, look, no hands. His face is inside the motorcycle. No hands and no eyes. Mario, don't drive like this. This is extremely dangerous. I do not condone this type of behavior. This is not the way you should be driving, Mario. This is very, very dangerous. Yeah, this is what happens if you try to use the rocket nozzle while you're on here. So weird that you can throw Cappy while you're on this. Look at how Mario's spinning around while he's on the motorcycle. This is so strange. I haven't seen anything like this before. This is so weird. Yes, this is how I ride a motorcycle also. This is how I ride a motorcycle in real life. I go just like this. Okay, so normally there is a jump that you want to make here. It's something like this. Go with something like that, and there we go! Okay, that's so cool that you could just make it up without flood, but you also could use flood to make it a lot easier to make it up. Now let's just drop down in here, get that power moon, because that's a nice and easy one. Oh, and let me also charge up on this, so right when we come out, we could just get boosted up like that right away, which will be lovely. And now, this jump should also be very easy. Oh, and look, we can just go straight down! That's not where I wanted to go! Goombas, stay back. Stay back, Goombas. You know what? Why not take this? We'll take that up. That's a nice and easy way to go up. Now just let me have that power moon. Perfect. Now are we safe? Oh, and you know what? Let's see if we can just get straight to the top from here. Oh, I don't know if I have enough water. Let's try it. Okay, let's try this now. Boost me again. Okay, not all the way to the top, but at least we made it up to there. We were able to skip that inside section. So that's nice that we could just make it to here. And now, we can just battle this Mecha Wiggler boss, which is one of the toughest boss fights in the game, actually. And you know what? This is what we've got to try. Go like this. Go. 
Yeah, look at that. Wow, we actually dealt so much damage there. You know, you go. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Come on, launch. Launch, why are you not launching? No, don't launch at the floor. Why are you launching at the floor? Do not do this. Okay, let's see, go again. And come on, 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 come on. Don't move. No, there's still one left. Oh no. Wait. Oh, it is our chance to fire now. Okay, let's go. Attack. Okay, nice hit. Now go again. And hit again. Very nice. And go again. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Launch, please. No, 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 no. I don't know if those guys hurt me or if I shot at the floor. Okay, I think that those guys are actually hurting me. I want to be careful. I don't want to die. It'd be nice if we could not die. Not dying would be very nice if we could do that. If it would be a possibility. Oh, oh, oh. They're shooting out these things at us, so I guess that must mean that we're doing pretty badly, huh? Hey, what if I just destroy... Don't hurt me, please, bro! Okay, okay, that's fine. Wait a minute, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. What if we just... Fly to up here? Hey! You're not allowed to chase me up here! This is supposed to be out of bounds for the boss fight. Well, I guess it's kind of fair that they're cheating. Okay, let's... Uh, I wanted to get a nice shot from up here and snipe them, but I just blew myself up. And I have to restart from all the way over here. Oh, no. If we die, we have to restart from here. I guess because we didn't get any of the other checkpoint flags. Okay, let's try and take out this boss. It'd be very nice if we could take out this boss. Come here. Come here. Okay, there we go. That's a nice hit. Almost got all of them there. And let's just go again. Come on now. Come on now. Come on now. And there we go. That's all of them. Okay, great, great, great. Okay, now we can do this. Come on now. Come on now. And... Let's go. Is this our chance? Okay, there's one nice hit. Let's go. Let's go. And... Okay, there we go. There's some more damage. Okay. Okay, we didn't get damaged yet, which is very nice. Oh, boy. And my rocket almost went into the ground. And... How's that? Can I do one more hit like that? Let's just get some more water. Oh, you're running away. And I'm firing a rocket anyways. Okay, at least I took out that guy. Oh. Oh, no. You're coming towards me. Now, wait. Does that mean that we successfully got the first hit? Is that what that means? Or am I just being hopeful? Okay, I'm gonna stay up here so that the Mecha Wiggler can't get us. Yeah, and you can see that the Mecha Wiggler actually appears back behind that wall, and it also goes behind the other wall. But normally, you're not able to see this. So look, you can see that the Mega Wiggler, Mecha Wiggler is gonna run here. You can see that it actually goes through the wall like that, which is a kind of funny game mechanic to see. It makes sense because they don't have to make the Mecha Wiggler disappear from back there. There would be no reason to do that because normally you can't get up here in the game anyways. So it makes sense that they would do it that way. Oh, boy. Let's see. Let's see. Come on. How's that? Okay, a nice shot. Now, where are you going? Come on up. Oh, boy. I accidentally... Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. This is such a wild boss to try and do with, uh, well, the strategy that I'm using here. I think it would actually be much easier to just do this boss fight normally. I don't want to get too far away and mess up the boss. So let's see what we can do. Should I try and uh, hack again? Let's try. No, I have only one HP. I've got to got to play it safe, I think. I think playing it safe is the way to go. Let's go like this. Go like this. Okay. Come on now. Come on now. And give me a heart. 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 One of you give me a heart. There's a heart there. There's a heart there. There's a heart there. I need the heart. I need the heart. Okay, good. We got the heart. Very good. I was not panicked at all there. I was very calm. Guys, you know what they say. Calm is contagious. When you're in a high-stress situation, it is very important to be calm, even if you are not calm. Because then the people around you will also be calm. That's why I was so calm there. That is why you're so nice and calm there. Okay, let's get the guy, the thing. There we go. Now get the one up there. Come on, come on. Please let me get it. Please, 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 please. No! You monster! You little munchkin, how could you do this? How could you do this? Okay, should I try and finish it off with the rocket, maybe? I don't know, because we've been at this boss for a little while. I would like to be done with this boss. We've had enough of fighting this boss already, I think. Okay, let's see where... The target, there it is, there it is, there it is. Come on, get it, 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 get it. That only hit one of them! Or wait, wait, it did hit both. Stop! How did I die? I didn't realize my HP was so low. I like how as soon as we respawn, Cappy goes, we're still not high enough. <laughs> okay, there we go. Now the boss is defeated. Finally, this boss is now defeated, which should be very good news for us. 
We can finally continue with the game. Okay, let's go and get some more power moons now. So we know that there is a moon. Oh, and that guy's waving at us. Hello, sir. I have a present for you since you waved at me. This is the present that I have for people who wave at me. Whoa! Wait, he's walking away now! I just shot a rocket at him and then he turned around. It's like, oh, good to see folks looking all chipper over here. Oh, maybe that just happened to be the way that he was walking. I don't think he started walking away just because I shot a rocket at him. Maybe he thought, huh, you know what? I actually don't want a rocket shot at me. Yeah, okay, that's enough shooting rockets at that fella over there. That fella has seen enough. He's like, good to see folks are so chipper today that we just shoot a rocket at him. Wow, you could actually go so fast. Yeah, thing that's super cool about this power-up is you maintain the speed that you have before you start moving. So there's some garbage over there. Can we just explode it? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, we can just explode the garbage. That is perfect. You don't have to ground pound there. You're just like, wait, is all the garbage just gone now? I guess we exploded all of the garbage. And you could also grab this and fling ourselves to right there. Oh, I'm hanging onto the bench. I'm hanging onto the bench. Oh, I hope that we'd be able to just climb up because you can just fling yourself right onto the bench, which is cool. You're not from around here, are you? You're the first person to ever just sit down next to me. It's a lonely city. Here, take this. And we get a power moon. Thank you for the power moon, sir. Bench friends. You know what? Whoa! Whoa, that was a bit dangerous. That's so weird. I was wondering if maybe we could explode the bench, but I thought, no, there's no way we could just explode the bench. Can't explode the cars either. Well, not these cars, at least. Oh, maybe we could explode some of the other cars. Maybe we could have exploded the explodable cars. Well, I guess uh, that's a bit of begging the question there. Can we explode the explodable cars? I was wondering if maybe we could send this rocket in here and collect the power moon with the rocket. That would be a very, very narrow gap there, and I'm not sure if that is possible. I think it might just be a better idea to just use this car and get it with the car. Yeah, that is much faster. That's definitely much faster than trying to get it with the rocket. So where else shall we go and what else shall we do? Perhaps we could play some jump rope here. We can do some rope skipping over here. We can perhaps get to 30. Getting to 30 shouldn't be too difficult. In fact, when I start to get close, I may just use my hover nozzle, and that might be a quick way to reach the required 30 there. We are at 15, so we are more than halfway there. I think I'm getting tired of jumping. I might just float from now on. Oh, boy! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I almost messed up, actually. Okay, let's just keep floating. Okay, now I'll just float. This should be fine, right? Can I just float up here? Wow, I could float all the way up here. I can just float all the way up here. Oh, now all of a sudden I missed. I guess if you get too high up above it, then it counts as a miss. Okay, but there we go. Now we got that power moon. That's splendid. That will not be a problem any longer. Oh, and it's so nice being able to use Flood to just move around basically wherever you want. Just boost me up. And you can get onto the tops of buildings quite easily. Oh, and you know what else we can do? We can, of course, go over here and this you could probably make yeah you can make that jump without flood even oh you know what i want to try though what we've got to try let's see how good we'll be at this go yeah all right that's so good that we are able to do that i'm so glad that that worked okay yeah because normally you want to ground pound there but what we did was just wait wait can i get up here or no let's see let's wait a moment for it to charge up boost me again and still not high enough oh no Oh, no. But yeah, that was super cool that what we were able to do there was just, hold on, boost me again. I don't think I could get boosted again, can I? I can! We got the triple boost. Okay, very nice. And just give me that. Perfect. Yeah, so we just used the rocket instead of uh, ground pounding there. That's quite funny that we did that. Now, can we get up this way? Let's see. And boost me up a little more. And maybe, can I get boosted one more time or did I use too much water? Let's see. Perfect, okay. Yeah, so we basically did that backwards. That is super cool. And look at the little reflections that you could see in the water bubbles. So funny that we got this one now. Oh, and our water's not filling up. We have to reach some kind of ground. We have to stand on something. Oh, I was hoping that we'd be able to just stand up there to refill our water, okay. But, just be able to go like this, I think. What if I go like, oh, that did not work how I was hoping it would. I was hoping that we'd be able to just do a nice quick roll there, but be able to just grab this power moon also quite easily. How do they take out the trash? That is a good question. And what I wanted to do was something like 
that so that we could move nice and quick like this. And we can easily make our way over to here. And then round pound on top of that to get that power moon. Oh, and then uh, we could also talk to that musician for a power moon, but we can't really do that right now because we didn't talk to Mayor Pauline yet, I think. I think you have to talk to Mayor Pauline first. So can we make it back there? Let's see if we could do something like this. Let's try this. Go so like this. And, oh, we're not high enough. You know what? We could try going off of this rail. Oh, this'll be crazy. Let's see. Let's try this because I want to maintain a lot of speed. Okay, there we go. That's a pretty good speed. Okay, we should be able to make it to there, I think, right? Yeah, we didn't even have to switch to another nozzle before switching back to this one. Hello, I'd like to get some power moons, please. Can I get some power moons for speaking to the musicians? Here's one musician. Oh, musician, sir. I'd like a power moon, please. Thank you. And another area that we can, of course, go is, wait, not this one. It is this building here. So let's just... I knew I would bog there! I knew it! I was just looking at the entrance, I'm thinking, you know, that's not a very big entrance there. I just knew that I would bonk there, somehow I knew. And you know what? Let's use this nozzle, so that we can run nice and fast here. And let's see if that- hey! Hey! Why did my nozzle stop? Whoa! Whoa, you really squeezed through those people like a knife just slicing through butter there. And another nice place that we should be able to go. Oh, what the? Okay, I kind of forgot about that slight ceiling there. But we could just jump up like that and get this power moon that's hidden here easily. And we need two more, so you know what? Why not get the two that are in this... Oh, great job bonking into that there. Let's just get the two that are in this sub area here. And I like how we left Flood behind as we went into the pipe. Oh, and of course there is a rocket here, so let's take this rocket to the sub area. I forgot that it's a rocket to a sub area, not just a sub area directly. Okay, so let's see. There's the one power moon that's up there. Oh, and wait, maybe we could do a double or triple rocket boost right here. Let's see this. Boost me up. Okay, then swap. Okay, now wait. Boost me again? Oh, and that's already high enough. I thought that maybe we'd need one more. Wow, that doesn't go as high as you thought it might be. You might have thought that this building actually goes up higher. That's a nice, quick, and easy way to get here and get this one. Perfect. Now, can I get boosted? Does my boost work? Boost me. Boost me. Okay, there we go. We made it up. Perfect. And now... You just get the power boom down here. This is such a weird way to be playing this game. Oh, that's so cool how the long jump just went right into that. And that is enough power moons for this kingdom. So now we can just teleport right back to the Odyssey and go to the next kingdom. Okay, so apparently there's a moon somewhere up here. Yeah, it looks like there's a moon just up there. So you know what? Let's see if there's a nice way that we could get up there. Maybe we can get up there from here. Let's see if this will be nice. I don't know if we need two rocket boosts or if one rocket boost is enough. Let's... See if we can go like this. Oh, one rocket boost is more than enough. Look at how high we are up here. Yeah, that'll be not a problem at all to get that power moon. That's very nice. And we could also get the Captain Toad one. We should be able to get that. I remember when I was playing the Floor is Lava version of this, it was, um... It was a bit difficult and we were a bit limited with where we could go. So that's where you normally want to go to continue the kingdom. But... We're going to keep going here first because somewhere around the wall here... Oh, I like how we're sliding here. Somewhere around here, there's a Captain Toad, right? Where's the Captain Toad here? Here, fishy, fishy, fishy! Where's the little fishy, fishy? Oh, right in here. This has got to be where Captain Toad is. Hello, Captain Toad. Mario! Fancy meeting you here! That's right! It's me, Captain Toad! Traveling the world looking for power moons! Luckily, I found a power moon in here! Here you are! I like how we're behind the wall, but you can still see Mario behind the wall during that cutscene when he gets the power moon like that. This kingdom sure is cool! Okay, let's see. Where do we want to go? Oh, that's actually so cool how you can move with the turbo nozzle like this. And it's cool that you don't bonk into stuff also. Okay, so you should be able to just head down here easily. And there'll be some power moons for us to collect also. We don't want to have to do the race. The race might be, uh... Yeah, because the race does take a while to do. I'm so glad that I was able to just dive straight into that and not bonk. I was so worried that we would bonk. Okay, we could buy a power moon from the shop, but kind of would like to just uh, collect power moons wherever we can. Okay, so here's one nice power moon for us. So nice that you could just get up like that quickly, because uh, normally you can also get up using those... Uh, what would you call them? Using the umbrellas? There's something that's kind of like an umbrella there. Oh, you know what else we could probably do? We could probably go like this. Explode here. And the power moon does come out. That's so cool that we didn't have to ground pound there. We could just use the rocket to get that. 
Oh man, this rocket is so cool. I really like this rocket edition. And now which of these areas do we not want to go to? Let's go here first and let's see what's in this one. I can never remember which of these four are which ones. Okay, this is this one. So you know what? Let's just go. Where's- No, oh, that's not the one I wanted. You know what? I gotta switch back to it. And please boost me. Oh man, we're saved. We're saved. Oh boy. I was so worried that I'd be dead there because I wasn't sure what nozzle we had out. First, I wanted to use the hover nozzle, then I had the rocket nozzle out, then when I switched to snapshot, I thought that I accidentally switched to another one, so I had to charge up my rocket while we were stuck like that in snapshot mode, and luckily, we were able to recover. So that's kind of cool. We could also stack up those Goombas and get a Power Moon, but that's fine. We don't have to do that. Let's try coming here first, and let's see what's going to be in this one, because we only need four more Power Moons. It shouldn't be too hard to get four more, right? Yeah, it should be kind of easy getting them here. Let's just go like this. Oh, I missed it. I'd like to come back and get it, actually. What's going on? I can't see where we're going. Okay, there we go. Two. Over here is three. I should be using the one that makes me go fast. Should be using the turbo nozzle right now. Go. Go. Okay, there we go. Now let's go. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. And come on. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. There we go. Okay. Now, which one is rocket? I don't know if rocket is one to the left or one to the right or how many to the left or right. Okay, that's that one. I need this one perfect. Okay, this is what we need. Oh, I should have gotten boosted while I was on that guy. Let's go like this. Okay, you bring me up. Okay, let me jump for a moment. Now bring me up to here. That's an easy way to get this one. Okay, so there's one more power moon for us. Now we're gonna get a second power moon here, and then after that... Uh, is that the right one? That's not the right one. That's the one that we need. Oh boy. Please bring me up and go get it. Okay, there we are. Man! You've got a lot of nozzles, and it's kind of difficult to sometimes switch between them. You have to remember which one is one to the left or two to the right, or or what combination of left and right you have to press to switch between one nozzle and another. Because in Super Mario Sunshine, I think you could only have two nozzles at a time. You always have this spray nozzle, and then one other one. I think you could only have the hover or the rocket or the turbo. I don't think that you could have any other combination other than that. You have to have one of those three, and you always have the spray nozzle. Well... Or you could have, uh, no nozzles at all in some situations. Okay, so this should also work out fine if we could do something like this. Let's just go like this. Oh, and look, in snapshot mode, when you swap, you could actually see that you are swapping to a different one. Oh, oh, I actually don't want to trigger the boss fight. I'd actually just like to come and get this power boot here. That's crazy! Being able to do multiple rocket nozzle boosts like that is actually wild how useful that can be and how high you can get and how many parts of the game you can just skip easily. Okay, so we're not gonna do that boss fight there because that isn't too important right now. Where we are going to go, we're just gonna head here and... Wait, which one is it? I think it's this one? Did we come from there or did we come from here? It would make sense that the dark area that we have to go to is down there, and then the top one... Okay, perfect, perfect. Yeah, that does make sense, yeah, because this area looks like it would be darker. It does make sense that it would be like that. Okay, let's just float over to here. And something that I saw just Khan to do, you could actually just go like this, and instead of using captures, you should be able to just take out these spinies using the, uh... rocket like this. That's a good amount taken out there. Come on, everybody, just group together, please. Group together now, please. Perfect. Everyone just gather around, please. Oh, you guys aren't coming here. Looks like I have to send a special present to you guys. Come here. Oh, boy. Sometimes kind of hard to aim at them. Okay, let's see. Where are you guys going? Come. I have something for you. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Okay, those guys are just too close. I don't know if I could get them. I don't know if I could aim that low. Let's see. I missed. The spiny is just a ghost over here. Went right through his body. No, it didn't go right through his body. Okay, now let's just get this one here. Let me just try aiming straight down. Perfect! Is that all of them? Amazing! Now we can get the power move. This probably isn't as fast as it would have been if I had just tried to do this normally, capturing the Typhoon and then just blowing them all off. But it was nice to do it this way. I didn't really want to blow them off. It was nice to test out the new rocket that we have that is connected with the spray nozzle. So, that should be enough power moons for this kingdom, right? Yes, it is. So now, we can just go back to the Odyssey. We can go to the next kingdom, the Seaside Kingdom. All right, this Seaside Kingdom is next. A nice, warm kingdom. A great place to be on vacation after a nice, cold winter like in the Snow Kingdom. And we should be able to get up to some... nice places here. Okay, wait, let's just charge up and boost me up again. And... 
Can we get some more nice? Oh, nice. We should be able to make it to there, I think. Okay, let's just tap a bit like this so we don't use up too much water. Oh, no. Can we even make it? And nice. Okay, I wasn't sure if I wanted to go to this one first or Captain Toad. I wasn't sure if I would have been able to make it to Captain Toad, so I just came here first. But that was a nice and quick, easy one. And from here, we can, of course, easily make it over to Captain Toad, where we will get another power moon. We've been seeing a lot of Captain Toad today. This is, what, our third or fourth power moon from Captain Toad. We got one in the Cascade Kingdom, I think, and then also the Snow Kingdom. So now we can just boost on over to here and get that power moon. Okay, those were three quick power moons that we just got there. We're definitely getting some power moons very quickly here. And now, hold on, we can just come on in here, right? I think we can just boost on up here. Oh, I didn't need to boost that much. That was a little bit excessive, perhaps. Just get the moon. Where's the moon? Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, let's just stay calm, everybody. Wasn't sure where the moon was depth-wise, but now we got it. Okay, depth Depth-wise or depth-wise? Depth-wise. Yeah, what am I saying? I don't know what words I'm even saying anymore. Okay, now we can make it over to this rocket ship. Should we go up here? You know what? Let's go up here. Why not go up here? There should be two power moons that we could get here, I think. Okay, and we should be able to do something nice to get to there. Let's go like this. And now we should be able to just float over to here relatively easily. Will we have to swap? Okay, let's just swap just in case. There we go. Okay, we did a swap to the hover nozzle and back because normally there is a limit on how much you can use the hover nozzle but if you just uh if you just swap back and forth between the hover nozzle and another and another nozzle then you can keep floating again let's just grab that there we go another power moon waiting in the cloud sea so let's go back to the main kingdom and we only need four more power moons that's actually kind of unbelievable we are definitely getting some power moons very quickly here so now where do we want to go we can possibly make it up to there and with multiple rocket boosts it shouldn't be too difficult i think let's just go like this charge up boost me up again and there we are okay now we can reach that easily without any problems at all yeah plenty of water to spare and we can still make it over to here open that up grab a nice power moon here now how many more do we need three more i think yeah now we need three more but wait is there also a power moon down here that we could get somewhere I vaguely remember that there's something in here. Is there something in here? There's got to be something here, right? Oh, oh, that's a sub area. Do we want to get those two? You know what? Let's get those two. Why not? We'll go to another sub area here. This should be one that's relatively easy, and we could probably also do this without the, you know what? We could probably do it without capturing these guys, because normally you want to capture these guys, but... We should be able to just do it without them. We should be able to just go like this. Oh, and our water's already full. Yeah, so this is no problem at all. Just go like this. Okay, now don't squirt, mate. No squirting allowed. Okay, let's go like this. Let's see. I'll charge up. Go like this. Boost me up. And now I'll just do this. Oh, oh, I thought that this was already the final section. Okay, but there's still plenty of time here. So let's see. We want to go nice and fast. We want to go very, very fast. So let's try this go like oh no oh no oh whoa that was weird i thought that we would bonk okay but you know what i think a long jump would be fine also if we do a long jump like that we should be moving with sufficient speed i think do we have enough height here though uh oh uh oh uh oh don't touch the poison keep going now keep going now we have to reach it to that okay good good because if we didn't reach it to that then we'd have to redo this entire thing to get to this chest oh actually even if we fell down here, would we be able to boost up if we made a mistake here? I don't know if that would work. Let's see if it would. Oh, that's so nice that we ground pounded onto the power moon. Let's see if we could get back up there. With three rocket boosts, maybe we would be able to make it back up there. Let's try our best. Let's see. Okay, let's go like that. Then swap. Okay, then get ready. Charge up and boost again. Okay, now swap and boost me again and... Come on! No! We can get so close. Okay, so if you do want to get back up there, it would be tricky. I think you can use up to five rocket boosts from the ground if you play it perfectly, but I'm not exactly sure what the ideal timing is supposed to be like. So the most that I've been able to manage so far is about three. So yeah, it probably should be possible if you play it perfectly. Okay, now let's see. Can I just get these? Oh no. Whoa! I completely messed up. I don't think I've ever messed that up before, actually. But that was weird because we were using the Rocket Flower and the other boost. But I think if you use just one or just the other, that it should be easier. So let's give this a shot. Now, can I just run straight? And... Yeah, look at how easy that is. All you have to do is just run straight. And then... 
You can just come here. Oh, I wanted to do a dive actually, but there we go. Okay, and now we have enough power moons to go to the next kingdom already. This was another very nice quick kingdom and we already have the 10 power moons so we can go to the next kingdom and we should be getting close to the end of the game now i think next is luncheon then ruin then bowser then moon and that's it all right the luncheon kingdom let's see where we can go for some power moons whoa no oh boy okay that could have gone worse that's okay just let me get up here that's what i wanted to do perfect now can we do this this shouldn't be too bad right wait 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 i got a funny idea for how we could do this one what if we just go like this and that's such a funny way to get it. We can basically skip the entire point of it. Normally, you're supposed to do wall jumps off that side, but we could just go like this. That's a very funny way to do that. Okay, and now let's just long jump across to here, and it should be no problem at all to make it over to this power moon. Okay, let's go get some more power moons. Where can we go and get some more power moons? There's going to be another one right over here. So wait, can I go like this? Ground pound and go like that. That's a nice, fast way to move. Okay, now just don't bonk. Perfect, give me that one. Okay, now let's just charge up our rocket. Hopefully our rocket is charging. Bring me up. Perfect. There we go. Now, do I want to face this boss or no? Hmm. Can we maybe go around this boss? What if we just leave this boss alone? Can we skip the boss? We'll just let the Brutals be there. Can I go down here and get this Power Moon, though? Oh, nice. Oh, whoa. I didn't know that you could ledge grab there. Okay, let me down. Let's get this Power Moon here. We can, of course, just... Whoops. Oh boy, that's not what I meant to do. I wanted to just float along here. Let's just get that one right there. Perfect. And now we should be able to just float back. Mario is a bit burnt right now because he did land in the lava. Let's just float on back and don't bonk. Good, we made it through without bonking. And hold on, there's gotta be a power moon somewhere around here, right? Where was the power moon? Oh, I think the power moon was right up here, right? Yeah, right. Here is the power moon. Oh, I should have shot a rocket at it, actually. I forgot that we could launch out the rocket. So you know what? Why not come in here and get a power moon in here? Because we could pay some coins and then we could play this game. Let's do it. Okay, and I think that just can't test this and I think this didn't work, but I would like to try it. Ah, oh, it's too bad that you can't activate these over here. It's too bad that you can't activate those with the rocket. Okay, so let's see. You want to go after the heart, right? Okay, let's see. Go now. Okay, nice, we got three, and now, after the heart, go. Perfect, that was almost too late, but I'm very glad that we got that. And we get the power moon, and now we can get out of here. Okay, let's just make our way out of here, and just float on up here, and something that we should be able to do, normally you just wanna throw Cappy down there, but maybe, just maybe, we can do something special here. Yeah, we can just explode that, that is nice, okay. So we can just get the power moon like this, and now we can head to here because we want to ground pound right here go oh boy sometimes when you hover for too long that starts to happen you just let go of the hover button and you're ready to come down but your game thinks no no you shall keep hovering you're not ready to stop hovering yet but why didn't you stop mario where are you going oh my goodness it's so crazy sometimes you just keep hovering and you keep hovering you think no I would not like to hover, but the game thinks, no, you must hover. It is time for you to hover, sir. You must keep hovering, for it is the hovering time, sir. You think, no, no, please, stop hovering. I've had enough of this hovering. Okay, what if we go like this, then swap, okay? Now boost me up again, okay, and swap, and... Boost me up one more time. Oh, no, and that still isn't high enough. Oh, that is so sad. Very, very sad times here, so sad, but... If we come up here, we could let our water refill. And from here, we should be able to make it high enough without any problems, right? Just go like that. Charge me up again. Okay, now let's just really wait to charge up. And there, now you can boost me up. Okay, there we go. And where's our nozzle that we need? Hopefully we're on the right nozzle. Oh, it's funny that it says fork flicking, but we weren't flicking any forks here. Nice dive into the power moon. I'm so glad that I didn't just bonk into the wall there. That could have gone so much worse than it did. And that also could have gone worse than it did, but I didn't bonk into the wall on my way out, which is great. Now, where do we want to go? Let's say we want to head this way. Oh, and we should be able to make it up there without too many problems, right? We can just go like this and give me the moon. Amazing that we got the moon, very nice. Atop the jutting crag. Oh, and something that we also should be able to do is when we come over here, we should be able to just break some of this cheese over here with our new missiles. Hopefully we don't hurt ourselves too much. Wait, did I not damage it? That's so weird. I would have thought that we'd be able to blast through this cheese. 
Are we not blasting through the cheese? What in the world is going on here? I thought that we'd be able to blast through this cheese. Oh, okay, well, I guess now we blasted through the cheese. That's something, okay, so now we can use Cappy, and now we can get this Power Moon here. How many more Power Moons do we need? Let's see. Wait, why is there no Power Moon here? What's going on? Oh, maybe this Power Moon isn't here yet because we didn't defeat the boss yet? I'm guessing that's what it must be because that's actually so strange that that isn't there yet. So maybe we do actually have to take on the boss? That's kind of surprising though. Hold on, what if we just go up here? What if we do this out of order? Hopefully I don't uh, lock myself out of this. I wouldn't want to lock myself out of being able to complete this kingdom. Yeah, look, we can't grab this yet. Interesting, what if we try and head up there? Can we head up there yet? Let's see if we can. Let's go like this, boost me up. Okay, then swap. Now charge up on water. Boost me again, okay. Now swap. Now is there anything up there or no? Let's see, boost me again. And I don't see any power moons up there, so that's actually bad. Oh, and I kind of need to land on something. Oh, that's not what I meant. Oh, get me up there. Oh, I thought we'd survive. Hey, you know what? I guess maybe we can go and take on the boss. And it's so nice that you could just float over to the boss like this. It's so easy to get from one part of the kingdom to another. Oh, and you know what? While we are here, we might as well take this, because this is one of the gold, you know what's one of these gold turnips or gold radishes. You can just throw that in there, and now we'll have a power moon spun for us around here. Am I in the right spot or no? Let's see, will it spawn on me? Oh, and perfect, okay, we were able to just get that one. Golden turnip recipe one. And we still do need a few more power moons, so I guess we'll go and take on the boss here. We probably don't have to, there are probably some other areas that we could just go to, but let's come here. Hello there, Brutos, look, I'm one of you. Look, I'm part of the ship, I'm one of you guys. Can I join you guys, please? No? Why can't I join you guys? Okay, I guess I'll fight you then. Okay, and this guy should be a relatively easy fight, but we did take damage right at the start. Okay, now get ready. Focus. Focus when you jump. Now, right? Now. Good. Okay, let's go. Ah, hurt him. Go, Cappy. And there we go. The jump got him. Okay, very nice. Now let's go. Now get ready to jump when he goes like that. Oh, boy. No. No, come here. Come here. There we go, okay, now we got him. Okay, now let's just throw the hat at him. When is a good time to do so? And jump on him, and there we go, he is defeated now. <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Spewart. He has a nice outfit, doesn't he? And he didn't really spew out too much. Oh, wait, what if we try and escape from here? Let's see. Oh, you're just put into a bubble immediately. That does happen at a lot of these boss fights. If you try to escape, then you're put into a bubble like that. Okay, so now, of course, this bridge comes up, but does that mean that the Power Moon later on also spawns? Because earlier on, there's that power moon over there that we needed. Oh, the power moon is just over there out in the open now. Okay, so we should be able to get that relatively easily. Let's just make our way over to there. Oh, I'm moving in such a funny way. It's like I just land on the ground a little bit. And then we just keep going and then we hover. And there's another power moon. Okay, so we could capture one of these fellas over here and then we should be able to land in there. Good job getting it. And give me that power moon, please. Let me have this power moon, please. How many more power moons do we need? Oh, we need three more, so we actually don't really need this one because when we go up high here, we should be able to get a multi-moon, so we don't really need the one that's back there because there is another nice one back there that we could get. Hold on, let's just fly to here first. Okay, this isn't working the way that I was hoping it would. Okay, let me... Oh, nice! We do have enough water to get boosted up. That's lovely. Okay, so now we can just switch around like this. And now the bird will see us twitching around and it'll grab us. So that brings us to up here. Now let me just fill up on my water. And then should be able to go like this. Oh boy, that was such weird movement. But we got this multi-moon, so we now have enough power moons for this kingdom. We have one extra power moon, I believe. So we can go to the next kingdom. Cappy will say we're going to the Bowser kingdom, but first we'll actually have to go to the ruined kingdom. Okay, so apparently there is a way to skip past this and get to that building, I think you need to use three rocket boosts, or sorry, three or five, I can't remember, but you need to use a lot of rocket boosts and you have to do them very, very precisely to be able to skip past this section. But I've never been able to do more than, uh, never been able to do more than three rocket boosts together. So yeah, I won't be able to do that right now. I'll have to see how that is done. I'll have to see a tutorial for how that works. Okay, for now, I'm just waiting for this guy to come down. Come on down, come on, come on, come on now. Please come down. I'm gonna get zapped, but that's okay. That's okay that we got zapped there because, wait. Okay, I was thinking, wait, where can I start pulling these down? Okay, but there we go, now we can go like that. There's one hit on him, that's very nice. 
And you know what? Maybe I'll try and get healed before he starts attacking again. Is there a spot right here that I can go to? Yes, let's go to this. And don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. I'm warning you. I'll scream really loud if you hurt me. I'm warning you. I'm warning you. Okay, let's get ready. You're probably going to come down in a moment, so let's get ready. Come on up like this. And you know what? If you hurt me, that's fine. That's fine. I don't mind getting zapped here. I'll just be ready to go like this. And go. Then go there. Go there. Now ground pound. Oh, I ground pounded too early. I'm at one HP. I've got to be careful. Okay, let me out of here. Let me out of here. Let me actually uh, heal up a little bit because we're at only one health. So if something hits us, then we die. If we die, then that means we have to redo the boss fight. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 I don't know if we're high enough. Where's the other one? Oh boy. Oh boy. Should I try and go for the boss or should I go for the health? I'll go for the health. I am going to play it safe. I'm going to play it super duper safe. This might take one extra cycle, but come on now. Come on now. Go. I've got to get off the boss. I've got to get off the boss. We wouldn't have been able to do that in time because I was going a little slow. I wouldn't mind one more health too. Oh, there's some health there. Give me this one maybe. And let's go. And... Let me boost up here, and there we go. Now we'll just fly up here. Now the boss will be easy, right, everybody? Right, we're not going to have any problems now. Let's just see. Just let me down here. Okay, we got sapped a little bit, but can I start to take these? And come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't hurt me, don't hurt me. And there we go. The boss is defeated, and we still have two health. That is fine now. Goodbye, Mr. Dragon. You've been defeated. Look at those big chompers that he has there. And we can, of course, collect this, and now we'll be able to head over to the Bowser Kingdom next. And I thought this kingdom would be the final kingdom of the game. I thought the Bowser kingdom would be the final kingdom of the game. And soon, in another video, in my normal playthrough, we're actually going to soon be making it to the dark side and darker side kingdom, which is pretty exciting. I've never been there before, never seen them even. All right, let's go and get ourselves some power moons because there are a few power moons that we need. And I wonder how many of these sections we can skip by. I don't know if we can skip through all of them. That'd be quite wild if we could. Okay, let's try going like, this, so we can have a nice amount of speed. I didn't get boosted the way I thought I would there. That was very strange. Okay, let's try this again because that was quite weird. Let's go like that. Okay. And why am I doing it this way? Why am I doing it this way? Why did I try this? Oh, well, oh no! Get me up! Oh man, oh man, oh man! That's so wild that that actually worked. I wasn't sure if that would work or not. I almost messed that up because that was pretty close. But then I thought that we messed it up. Okay, so it's a good thing that we got that. Oh, that's so cool that we were able to get there without capturing the, you know what? Wait a minute, what in the world? What in the world? That was so weird, just the hat was there. The rest of it was invisible. I've never seen something like that. That was very strange. Okay, so where do we want to go next? Can we make it to there? Can we do this? There's no way we could do this, right? This is too crazy, right? Let's see. Uh, boost me again, and can I float to there? Maybe. Maybe if I just tap a bit at a time like this? Maybe. Come on, baby! Yeah! Oh, man, that's actually unbelievable that you could just make that jump like that. Okay, so these guys are little, uh, troublemaker munchkins sometimes, so I could just get rid of them like this, so they're not gonna be in my way once the, uh, once I touch that treble clef. Come here! There we go! What a nice shot that was! And now I should be able to collect these without any issues at all. I was able to do this when the floor was lava when I had Flood. So it should definitely be very easy to do like this now that the spinies are gone. Let's just get that power moon. Perfect! Oh boy, this is so cool that this is basically my third time playing through this game with, um, whoops. It's basically my third time playing through this game with Flood. But I'm still learning new things, and I'm still trying new strategies. Man, there's just so much versatility for what you can do when it comes to playing through this game with Flood. You have Flood, you have Cappy, you can use the rocket nozzle multiple times, you can combine that with the hover nozzle. It's just absolutely wild what you can do. And wait, is there a moon up here? I would have thought that there would be a moon up here for some reason. I guess it's not up here. There must be a moon in another section. Okay, so now the question is... Can we make it up all the way to there? There's no way that I can make it up to there. There's no way. You'd have to do probably... You'd have to do probably five or so rocket boosts. I don't know how to do that, though. Let's try this. Let's try this now. What if I go like that? 
Swap to that one. Okay, let's charge up again. Now let's see what happens. Okay, try again. Okay, now swap, swap, charge up. Okay, now just wait. Okay, swap, swap, swap. Okay, charge up. I don't know if I have any more water after this or no. Let's see. Oh, uh, somehow I was still able to do one more. That was four that I did there. And we are pretty high up. But no, we have no water at all, so we can't reach. Oh no, that is so sad. Maybe with three rocket boosts, we'd be able to reach. Okay, that jump might be possible to make it all the way to there, but it would be pretty difficult. You'd have to make very, very good use of the, you know what? You'd have to make very good use of the rocket nozzle. And I'm not incredible with it. I don't really know how to uh, switch. Uh, get it, please. Yeah, we got that. Okay, that's so cool that you could collect that with the missiles that you launch out. Okay, now where shall we go next? I guess we want to go that way. Wait, can I just fire out and collect that one from here? Let's go like this and one, please reach, please. Yeah, okay, we can get that one too. Okay, this is very nice. This is looking like it is going nicely. And wait, is there one also here? Oh, I was thinking of launching my uh, rocket at that, but I thought, you know what? That's right there. We can just go like this. That'll be fine. Now, hold on. Is the final one under that shiny spot? Maybe we have to go in here. Can we explode it like that? Yes, we can. We can just get it like that. That's incredible. And we also do want to explode this place right there because there's a spot to stick our nose in there. If we stick our nose in there, then we can get a power boom. But we have to capture one of these Pokios first. We can't just stick our own nose in. Oh, and speaking of sticking our nose in places. Oh, come here. Good job. Good job. Good job. There is a game called Super Kiwi 64, where it's a Nintendo Switch game. It's on the Nintendo Switch eShop. It's also on Steam. You play as basically a bird that is very much like these Pokios from Super Mario Odyssey, and you have a really similar moveset. It's a cool game. I definitely recommend checking it out. I have a video about playing through that game, and the game's super cheap. I think it's like a dollar or two on the eShop. Yeah, if you want to play a game that has Nintendo 64 art style and really has the feel of a Nintendo 64 game, I would definitely recommend checking that game out. It feels very much like Banjo-Kazooie or Banjo-Tooie, and also a little bit like Super Mario 64 and Donkey Kong 64. It just feels like one of those types of games. And I think over here there might be a Power Moon, right? Yes, there is the Power Moon that we need. Perfect. And now then, there's going to be uh, that boss fight around here, right? We're going to have to face two more Brutals in a moment. Wait, can I skip past here? We have to fly to all the way over there. I don't know if we can make it from here. That seems very far. It really seems like we're pushing our limits here. Let's just try our best. Go like this. Okay, then we could charge back up and get ready. Okay, then go. Okay, now wait, did I press the button already? I can't remember what button I pressed and what I have to press. Okay. Oh, I uh, shouldn't have done that. I should have done this nicer. What nozzle do I have out now? Okay, I've got this one out. And I'm out of water. We can get kind of close. If I could do one or two more rocket boosts, because I think there is a way to get five rocket boosts. I think that's what the creator was saying. The creator was saying that you could get up to five rocket boosts if you time it perfectly and you know the strategy, which I don't know how to do currently, but I think it should be possible with that. And you know what? Why not grab one of these guys and... Bring them in place here. Look at the little birds that are running away. But if we do this, then we can just get a nice power moon here. And now we've got plenty of power moons collected. So can we make it to the next area? This one doesn't look as bad. That doesn't look like it's super far away. But let's still try this. A charge up and... Oh, wrong one! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I don't know if I can make it now. Because now, yeah, we can't get anywhere near that. There is no point in really trying. Yeah, that, uh, it's a lot farther than it looked like it would be, I think. So what we'll do is we'll just, uh, take the amp across. Maybe if you know how to do more rocket boost, then you could get over like that. Wait a minute, do I have to face this boss here? Do I have to face these two little bosses, or can I just boost over them? I'd love to be able to just... Boost past them like this if it's possible. Let's see if we can do that. Let's see, boost me up again. And can I just go past them? Do I not have to face these beetles? No, there's an invisible wall there that's stopping us from going there. Oh no, that is so sad. Can I not get around the invisible wall? Let's see if we could. Let's go like this. 
Okay, boost me up. Let me just swap like this. Okay, get ready. Boost me again, okay? And give me one more boost. Maybe we can make it over. Come on, baby. Let me over, please. No, look at the invisible wall. It just won't even let us get there. So sad. Okay, I guess we do have to take on these bosses then. So first off, we have to take on Topper over here. You know what? I'll take him out with one of these. Ah, if I don't take out myself first. Come here. Come here, you little rascal. I'll get you. I'll get you. I'll get you. You ready? How did that not hurt you? I'll get you. I might die first, actually, but I'll try. I'll try. I'm surprised that I didn't defeat myself there. Okay, you know what? Looks like maybe I should do something else instead of trying to get him with the rockets, because with the rockets, I keep exploding myself. Okay, is he in this one? Perfect. That's what we like to see. Now can I just jump on him? Amazing. Two nice hits on him. Okay, where is he? He's in this one, I think. Yeah, okay. Okay, at least this is going great. Oh! <laughs> I knew that would happen. Maybe if I did a dive, I could have escaped that. Okay, but that's okay. We'll just try our best this time. Okay, let's see. Where are you going, bro? Come here. No, you're in this one or the other one? Get him. Okay, but this time we should be able... No, 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 no. Tell me we can finish him off. Tell me we can finish him off, please. Thank you. Thank goodness we didn't lose to him again. Oh, look at his little purple hair. Oh, and I keep thinking for some reason that you collect a power moon after defeating these guys, but no, you don't collect a power moon. It's just the statue gets defeated. I think maybe you get a power moon after defeating both of them. I'm not 100% sure, though. Okay, now this fight might be a bit more difficult. This was so difficult in the floor is lava, even though I had, uh, what is it called? Even though I had Flood with me, even with Flood in Floor is Lava, this was incredibly difficult. This was a very difficult boss fight. Okay, now where are you going to be? Because I only have one health, so I don't want you to give me any trouble here. Go! Yes! Okay, okay, we did that nice and quick. That's good. Now then, I don't want to get hurt by these. Let's see. Okay, you're throwing there. I'll just go like this. Okay, now let me just bounce on your head. Thank you very much. Now let's just see where you're going to go. Where are you going to go? You're going there. Go! Good job. Okay, now just throw it at me again. I'm ready for you. I'm ready. Just don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Oh, that was sooner than I thought it would be. Okay, but that defeats you. Now let me just get on your head. And there we are. You are also defeated. What's this lady's name? I can't remember what the name was of this brutal lady. There we go. Both statues are destroyed. Yeah, you do get a power moon, right? Yeah, you've got to get a power moon there, of course. And then that's what unlocks the gate. So let's just make our way to that one and... Perfect, we got this nice red power moon. Okay, we are almost all the way through Bowser's castle and we are almost at the final boss fight of this kingdom. So let's just get ready with our rocket nozzle here. Let's get ready to boost ourselves up here. And you know what? Let's just go like this, boost ourselves up again. And then we could just use the hover nozzle straight across to here. We should have enough water to make it to here nicely. Oh, and something cool that we should also be able to do if we go like, this and explode that one right there perfect wow i'm actually surprised that that was close enough for the explosion to work where am i okay sometimes it's a little weird where the camera is after that because it takes a moment for the camera to come back to you but it looks like we are okay now i don't think we have to defeat this guy i think we can just come up like this and let's just wait a moment for our rocket to charge up and take a second rocket boost up here perfect okay let's just get a bit more water then we should probably be able to boost up all the way here. Let's just go like that. Charge up the rocket for a moment. Boost me up again. Oh boy, oh boy. I let go of the, you know what? I let go of snapshot mode a little early there. That's so funny how you could just boost up like that. Now then, can we just go up to here? I think that we should probably be able to avoid this, right? Yeah, because look, we could just go to this. Oh, that's a little high though. I don't know if we can make it to there. Let's try it. Go like this. Boost me. Swap. Charge up. Let go. Boost me again. Swap, charge up, boost me again. Now let's just use the hover nozzle from here. Can I make it onto that Bowser maybe? Wait a minute, you can go down there. Maybe we actually can land on that gold Bowser and then get up, I've gotta try this. Okay, once we hit the death area, it took us long enough to fall. Hey, okay, let's try this again. I don't know if we can do this from here, but. Okay, go like this, charge up, wait. Boost and swap quickly, okay, now get ready. Okay, when you get as high as possible, Swap over to this one. Now let's just wait. Over boost me, please. Let me up here. Get me up onto the Bowser. <gasps> can we stand here? Yes. Yes, 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 yes. We can stand here. That means that it should be no problem making it up like this. All right. That's sweet that we were able to make it up like that. Okay, now let's just go and have this 
boss fight here against, what is this called? Is this called the Mecha Brutal? But either way, it is a uh, super easy boss fight with the rocket nozzle, because he could just come up like this. Just ground pound on that guy, that's nice. Now we can just uh, hover back nicely like this. Let me back up. Oh boy, let me back up. Let me back on, okay, very good. Let's just get this guy. Okay, nice, we got him, we got him. I'm so glad that that actually worked. That's very good. Now, are you gonna scream and push me off? Okay. Now just let me hear, let me hear, okay. I just wanna get this guy on this side and then the top one should be very easy to get. Just stop running around, just relax for a moment. Relax for a moment, I'd like to ground pound on this one. Relax for a moment, please stop running. Please stop running, please stop running. Okay, now let's go. I missed, I missed, I missed, I missed, I missed. Okay, that's okay. Just let me back up and let me back up here. Stop running around, just relax, just relax. Let me just get a ground pound right here. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Come on, come on, just stop for a second. Oh, you stopped. You actually listened. Okay, that's good, that's good. Now let me back up here and hey, I wanted to get a ground pound before we got pushed off like that. Okay, let's go now. Come on, come on. Let me just get that one. Come on, let me get you. Come on, come here. Come here. No, 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 go. Come on, where are you? There we go. Okay, are you defeated now? Is that the last one? Okay, there we go. That's all of them. It's defeated. That's so nice how you can use the rocket nozzle to get on top very easily. Then you can just use the hover nozzle to basically stay on top. And saving the one at the top for the end is a nice and easy strategy when you're using this method, I think. And look at that. We got some brutal fireworks there. And with this power moon here, I think we should have more than enough. I think we should be able to very easily make it to the Moon Kingdom. I think we do have the required amount of Power Moons for the Moon Kingdom, which will be the final kingdom of the game. And there's going to be something very exciting that we could do now that we have the rocket nozzle. And by rocket nozzle, I mean the spray nozzle that fires out missiles. All right, here we are. So we did have to take a break for a few days, but now it is time for us to continue. And we are at the Moon Kingdom which should be a nice kingdom. We can go nice and fast like this. And you know what else we could probably do? Let's try something like this. And maybe we can just hover on over to there. Can we just make it straight to there from here? Let's see if we are able to go that far. Let's just keep using the hover nozzle here. Actually, we might be running out of water. I don't know if we can make it across. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, our water's running very low. It's running dangerously low. What if I just tap like this right now? I probably should have done that sooner. Give me more water! We didn't make it, okay, but... Oh, we bumped into that. Oh, there also is the shortcut over here. You actually can do this shortcut over here without flood, but with flood, it becomes much more trivial. So hold on, normally, you want to get up onto this Sphinx's head here. From the Sphinx's head, you can do something like this. You jump, throw Cappy there, bounce off of that, jump here, now jump on this wall, and... All right, that was not bad. We made it up there very quickly, but another way that you can get up is, of course, you can just use the rocket nozzle, then you just go flying like mad all the way up. Oh my goodness, that actually brings you up very, very high. Okay, but our checkpoint flag is, of course, right here. That's the checkpoint flag that we need. And now we can just use our rocket nozzle to quickly run over here. And I remember back when we played this in Shadow Clone Odyssey and Shadow Clones were chasing us here. That was so difficult. All right, let's make our way into the wedding hall. Oh, oh, and I wonder, I actually want to try this. I wonder how this will work. Let's see if... Oh boy, I don't want to explode myself. Okay, that's all right. Okay, this isn't working how I thought it would. I was wondering if we could make our rocket explode the door over here, but it looks like that doesn't actually work. Our rockets explode shortly before they even reach the door. So that's kind of surprising, but wait a minute. Now in this showdown over here, what if I just launch rockets at Bowser from here? What if I go, hey, I'm going to save Princess. Oh, I guess I can't just go and save Princess Peach unless, go rocket. Yeah! Ah, oh, that'd be so funny if you could just defeat Bowser right now with the rockets. That'd be so broken. That'd be so funny if you could just do this. You could just launch these missiles right now. Just defeat Bowser right now with those, and then the princess is saved. How high can we get here? Oh, kind of high, actually. What an interesting perspective we could have of the wedding hall, though, because we're all the way up here. We can see the water from Mario up here. We can see the water from Flood up here. All right, let's come down to them. They're somewhere around here. Wait, what? Oh, I thought that I'd get past them. All of a sudden, it teleports you down here for this cutscene, though. But, of course, it is time for us to battle against Bowser now. Are you prepared, you Bowser monster? I request that we have a battle. I shall take you on, Fiend. I shall smack you like this. You shall swing your tail. I shall float. You will not hurt me, and I will punch you with my boxing gloves. That'll teach you indeed, rightly said, Cappy. Now, are you gonna try and blow fire? 
Well, that's okay. I can just hover here. And you can't hurt me with your fire because I can hover. It's kind of hard to get hit by the fire anyways. Sometimes when I play very poorly, I still do get hit by the fire. And I got hit by the fire right there. How silly is that? I have a hover nozzle and I got hit by fire. What kind of a noob am I? A big noob is the answer. Give me that. Yes, that's what we need. And... Oh, oh, that's so funny that I'm just floating like this. Mario's standing in such a weird way right now. Okay, but let's go over this way. Oh, don't touch me with your spiky balls. Keep your spiky balls away. Okay, now let's just get a few hits on this Bowser over here. Okay, I'll jump like that. Now, oh, oh, I almost forgot that I had to jump some more and I was worried that I'd get too close there and I would get hurt. Okay, but looks like, why am I lying down? What's going on? Get up, Mario. Mario, stop crouching. Why is the crouch button just constantly being held? That is so strange. I don't know what's going on. Uh oh. Yeah, the crouch button's just constantly being held. Uh oh. Uh oh. Am I okay now? Okay, I think maybe now I'm gonna be okay. Are you gonna stop blowing fire, bro? Okay, there we go. There we go. That's so weird. It's almost like my crouch button got stuck or something. I don't know what was happening there. Okay, let's see. Now, give me the- No, no, my crouch button's stuck again. What's going on? Why am I just repeatedly crouching and diving? That's so strange. What in the world? Okay, let's just try going like this. Go! No! Oh, well, uh, good thing I didn't die, I guess. I guess that could have gone worse. Okay, throw your hat again. Let me get the hat that I want. Let's go like this. Give me that. Okay, give me that. Now give me that one, give me that one, give me that one. Perfect! Okay, now let's just defeat you without too many weird things happening. Because some weird things were going on a moment ago. So now we should be able to just walk through here. And can I punch at you, please? I am not going to try and do anything too crazy right now because things have been going very, very strangely recently. Okay, swing again. Okay, that's enough swinging for you, bro. Actually, you're going to swing some more, aren't you? Is that it? That's got to be it. Now, there we go. Okay, now Bowser is defeated. And this ending is going to be very exciting because now Mario can launch out these missiles. So I think we actually don't have to capture Bowser in this final part here. So let's just run over here with the turbo nozzle. And all of a sudden, our turbo nozzle is gone. And the floor is all going to be collapsing here and we're going to fall down. But I think we actually don't have to capture Bowser here in this mod because we can launch the missiles now. Let's see if this will work. Let's see, okay, so we want to head over here. Very nice, very nice. Oh, are those two doing all right? Okay, so normally you want to uh, capture Bowser and then you're able to go through here, but what if we just go like this? Okay, that's nice. That's nice that we can just explode that. Can we go through? We can actually go through. Okay. All right, and I guess we can just continue now. Okay, so we'll just leave them behind. That's fine, okay. Can we come up here? Is there an invisible wall? Oh my goodness, we can just go through. And will this work? Tell me this works. This is beautiful! Oh, oh, and we actually blasted through a few walls together, so let's just be careful here. And, oh, actually, I'm not sure if we're blasting through the walls one at a time or if we're blasting through multiple walls. I'm not sure how it's working. Oh, I have to be careful to not die. I'm at only one HP. This is actually bad. Should I just die on purpose now so I get healed? Because we wouldn't want to accidentally die and have to redo this all over again. That'd be very sad, actually. That'd be incredibly sad. Yeah, it, and it takes quite a while to blast through these walls, actually. Oh, there we go. Okay, nice, nice. Okay, so we just blasted through there. That's fine. And let's just be careful they don't die. Wait, are these not gonna start coming down now? Because normally these are supposed to be falling. And the other cubes are uh, supposed to be coming towards us and trying to hurt us. But none of that is happening. I guess those over there are falling. Oh, and now here come these cubes. Don't hurt me, please. I have only one HP. I'm one hit away from dying. This is incredibly sad. I really hope that we don't die here. It'd be so sad if we died here. Because then we have to restart from the very beginning and this would take so long to do, so I don't want to die here. I don't want to die here. I don't want to die, Gary. We gotta be careful, Gary. Okay, can we... Uh, okay, maybe we can't get up there. I was wondering if we could get up there. I was wondering if that would be a nice way to get up, but maybe we can't do that. Get up, please! Good, 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 good. Okay, now then, is something gonna start coming from there to hurt us? Let's see. Go! And... Okay, that affected it a little bit. I'm so scared because if these missiles explode near us, they actually hurt us. And I've only one HP, so my kills. This is so. No! Uh oh. Now these are all falling. Okay, tell me we'll still be safe here, please. Okay, very nice. Come on now, just let me break this, please. Come on now. Come on now. There we go! Okay, this is falling. Wait, what's gonna happen in the 2D section? Oh, I love that those coins are still just floating there. That's where we died a moment ago. Okay, but uh, what's gonna happen in here? Because normally you become Bowser in this 2D section. So are we just going to be Mario in this 2D section? How are we going to make it through here? Wait, I can't go through the pipe. 
Can only Bowser go through this pipe? What in the world? Do we have to go over this then? Maybe we can get over this. Let's try it. Let's see. Let's see. And boost me up again. And can you boost me up one more time, please? Oh, perfect. Okay. All right. Okay. So he just made it through the 2D section like that. That's very nice because that 2D section is sometimes a little difficult. So it's nice that we could just avoid it. That's one way to do the 2D section. Okay. But now. Oh, no. That falling rock almost hit me. Good thing that you can actually move while, uh, while these, uh, falling rocks are falling towards you. Uh-oh. Don't explode me. Oh, go. Okay. Do they aim at you specifically, or do they aim at, uh, like, look, it looks like they're coming towards me on purpose. Let's see. Am I safe here? Is this a safe spot? Tell me this is a safe spot. No! No, 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 no. Very, very dangerous spot. Okay, let's go. Go. Okay. I'm at 2 HP. I'm so scared. I'm so scared because those rocks keep trying to fall on me. And I have to be careful that I don't accidentally hurt myself with the rocket. Okay, but now we can get through here. This is fantastic. Oh, boy. This is surprisingly one of the hardest parts of the game. Oh, no. No, if I mess up here, I would be so sad. I would be so incredibly sad if that happened. Okay, let's see. Go. Go. Okay, now I gotta run so I don't get hit by that. Okay. It's like, you gotta wait for the rock to start coming down, and then go. Good. Okay, now it's gonna start coming again, right? Yep, yep, there comes another one, okay. Let's be careful. When's it gonna come? Okay, there's one. Now go, 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 go. I almost exploded myself there. I'm so glad I didn't explode myself there. Okay, gotta keep moving. And let's see, when are you gonna start coming? Come here, good. Okay, now go here. Good. Come on, come on, come on, explode it, good. Where am I? And where's the rock? Okay, we are away from the rock, that is good. Now rock, come here. Okay, good. Now let's go. Go. Go, 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 go. Come on, how many of these do I have to blast through? Oh no, now I have to slash through this. Wait. Oh no, I was hoping that the rocks would stop falling now. Okay, and? Okay, nice. Okay, it only took one hit for that, that's fantastic. Is the music gonna be playing or no? Oh, now all of a sudden the music's playing. Oh, but we only have one health here. This is so scary. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. This is so difficult. And these platforms are all coming. And there are all those moving around. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. And it takes multiple hits to break this. Oh no. What am I gonna do? How can I avoid these? Go. Go, 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 go. How many hits is this going to take to break? But wait, nothing's coming down from above, is it? Can I just stay at the center and attack these from far? Yes, one fell. Perfect, perfect. Okay, there's one. Oh boy. Oh boy, guys, this is so terrifying. I don't want to have to do this again if we mess up. I really hope that we don't get hurt. It would be amazing if we didn't get hurt. Okay, now there are falling rocks there. Also, if I just stay back here, am I safe? Is this a safe spot to be? Please tell me this is a safe spot to be. Please tell me this is a safe spot to be. It looks like it's maybe safe. A heart! Get it, please. I am scared to go there. No, 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 My controller stop, my controller stop. Mario, 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 stop. Stop, 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 stop. Mario, what are you doing? What are you doing, Mario? Mario, Mario, get back up, get back up. Stop crouching. Why are you crouching, bro? Stop this madness. Okay, there we go. He stopped crouching. Now go. Thank you for getting the heart! Oh my goodness, I was terrified. I actually had to unplug my controller there. That was so weird. I don't know what's going on. I've never had an issue like that with this controller before. This controller's always been fantastic for me. So I'm actually surprised that something like that has started happening today. Oh, I almost got hit by that. That wasn't good. Okay, now let's just see. Where are we going? I didn't get hit. Thank goodness I didn't get hit there. Okay, now just don't fall, Mario. You gotta be careful, Mario. You gotta be very, very careful, Mario. What are we gonna do, Mario? We don't want to get hit by any of the... Oh, that one wants to spawn right there. Oh, and that one comes out like that. Let's see if this will be all right. Please tell me I'm in a safe spot where I won't get hurt. Please tell me I'm in a safe spot where I won't get hurt. Okay, I see... Oh, wait... Okay, good, 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 okay. I saw an explosion, but I thought, please tell me it's not close enough to hurt me. Stop it! I keep hitting that. Okay, you need to move, sir. Sir, you need to move. Let's go. Come on now. Hit this, please. Perfect. Wait, is this the last one or is this the second last one? Okay, this is the second last one. After this, we still have to get one more. Okay, come here. 
Come here. And okay, now it is going to be down to the final one. The final pillar. Oh no, we're sinking, we're sinking, we are sinking. Okay, let's make our way up. And we don't want to get hurt by these. Look out, bros. Oh, you can hit them with Cappy, what? I had no idea you could do that. Okay, am I safe here? This isn't gonna start sinking, is it? What if I stand here? Is this an okay spot? I better not fall here, I better not fall here. I hope so much that I don't fall here. Should I just stand near the center? Maybe I should just wait near the center. Maybe that would be better. Maybe it'd be easier to reach the center. If I fall, or if I lose all my health, I have to start over. I almost shot that rocket at the ground. Because you have to be basically tilting up. Oh no. Oh no. How did I not get hurt there? That was so weird. Quick, get to this middle. Cappy, I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can go that quickly, Cappy. Oh no. Oh boy. Oh boy, we're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. Okay, now go Rockets. Go Rockets. Go, come on. How many hits will this one take? Is that enough? Oh, look out! Please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Okay, and is that enough? Wait, do I go capture it now or what? Because normally you just walk into it with Bowser. So what if we go like that? Uh-oh, hold on. Let me get high enough. Let's use the rocket. Is using the rocket a good idea? Please get it. Come on. Wait! You can't grab this with Mario! You have to be Bowser to grab this? That's so silly! No way! What kind of ending is this? I really recommend you watch my video where we play Super Mario Maker 2 Endless Challenge. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day ahead of you. And take care, everybody.